Hello all, in this video we will see how to create a widget for a particular device. In the previous video we have seen how to create a device and its parameters, right? So now let us go straight away to devices. Okay, so temperature sensor was something which we have used previously. Let us go to it. Okay, and then here what we will do is we will go to the latest telemetry device. Uh, telemetry uh, data. Okay, so now here um, click on this you see show on widget okay you will see the widget data okay now that uh, the device is disconnected we are not seeing anything okay now for example if we connect something uh, we we will we will receive data here right you can see we connected the device and uh, we receive we start receiving the data now if we click on add to dashboard so now the thing is we wanted to represent this in a form which can be easily understandable to the user so for that we have something called widgets right widgets are something uh, where you can represent the data in a visual form and that is the speciality of these portals like thinkboard right so now for that what we do is click on add to dashboard okay so you can there are several dashboards if you see on the left there is something called dashboards okay you can use the existing dashboard or you can also create new dashboard for example let us try to create new dashboard so we will name it as node mcu dash temperature sensor okay so we will use this now you you can click on open dashboard or you can also say add now if you add this is a dashboard that is created so go to the dashboards okay see here the name appears node mcu dash temperatures dash sensor so now click on it and you will see the dashboard so this is the dashboard where you see your um, temperature sensing data now we have seen this in the um, devices page right so let us assume we want to add a device so if you if you if you see on the right corner there will be something called um, enter edit mode so click on that okay when you click on it three buttons appear add new widget apply changes or decline changes so click on add new widget which is a plus sign so when you click on it you see three options import widget if you already have a widget from some other um, portals you can uh, uh, explore import widget now what we are doing is creating a new widget okay so when we click on it we see number of widgets these are called the widget bundles where you can use for your data so now we will use analog gauges okay click on analog gauges and you will see again number of uh, uh, readings uh, number of types of widgets we can use any of them we will use the simple radial gauge click on it and once you click on that you get this option and then add a data source okay and if you once you click on add data source you get this entity entity is what uh, um, will be adding the parameters so if you if you click on this you can see under the parameters you already have temperature sensor okay so if you, you can select it and then if you click on it you will see a uh, number of options for now we will only select temperature which we want to display okay so we are we are displaying uh, the temperature and then uh, these other settings we will see later click on add okay once you add click on add you can see the temperature widget is up okay so let us try to connect the device okay and you see uh, here apply changes now once we click on apply changes the changes are applied you can see the temperature the reading is around 29 you can see on the analog gauge it is around 29 so this is how we add widgets to the think board for a particular device Mm, and the device is receiving data from an external board 
um, like a node MCU and to the node MCU, there's something like a DST11 connected. So this is a sequence of uh, uh, things that are happening here. So this is a very basic widget creation uh, tutorial. Please post if you have any questions. Please let us know if you are facing any problems creating this. Thank you.